they're anxious to get back to work just like everyone else and get their power back on. They say just from catering customers and canceling those orders alone, they lost thousands of dollars. Just been missing out on a whole lot of business. Uh, losing catering orders, uh, you know, losing customers. You know, people, people love to eat here with us. We're not able to provide the good service that we normally uh, provide. Josephine's Kitchen is nearing a week being closed. The North Jackson restaurant has been closed since Friday after severe thunderstorms knocked out power to tens of thousands. Owner Lee Vance III tells us he's missed out on a significant number of business inquiries. Probably about 12,000. 12,000? Yeah. Missed out, missed out on a, a wedding catering couple of businesses. We may miss out one on Friday if this stuff not correct. Vance calls the damage done a total loss. We uh, also got bills like the food truck bill. You know, we order food, we took a loss on the food. You know, that gotta be paid for and replaced. Josephine's is known to be a community staple that's named after Vance's grandmother. It's well known in the neighborhood, so much so, People are still coming through an empty drive through looking for a taste of Vance's soul food. They ready to fight me. <laughs> they ready to fight me. They, they, they looking for me. They, like, they want their wings, they want their pastas, they want their soul food. Well, Vance says considering that everybody else in the surrounding area has received their power back on, he's not sure what the holdup is. He says he cannot wait to begin getting plates back in his customers' hands again. We reached out to Entergy for more information on power restoration, and they reiterated they are still working quickly to get people's power back on. Tonight, we're live outside of Entergy. Michaela Franklin, 16 WAPT News.